Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network. It's a disease common in the tropics that causes sudden fever and acute pains in the joints. But while dengue fever can be debilitating, it's not contagious and can only be spread by infected mosquitoes. Public Health Director James Gillen. The thing about the dengue virus is that it has a fairly short infectious period. Gillen says his team determined the patient who tested positive for dengue contracted the disease off-island and has likely passed the infectious period. The patient was hospitalized at the Guam Memorial Hospital on Monday, monitored and will be cleared today. He says the case shows his agency's epidemiology surveillance center is working. We prepare a daily report, we call our situation report. And we have, uh, we have really proactive partners like FHP, the hospital, our own public health clinics that report certain types of illnesses that fit a profile that may indicate that there's something going on. Free insecticide spraying booths are also set up at the three main FESPAC venues. So what are the chances that this case of dengue could spread to the rest of Guam? We believe that, you know, just playing the numbers game by the, by the 4th of June, you know, the, the possibility of any, any transmission is, is next to zero. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Isa Baza. Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network.